Thanks for waking up with us here on Good Day in Memphis. It's Wednesday at 7 o'clock. I'm John Paul. Millions of dollars up for grabs for people struggling to keep their lights on. And the organization behind it says they are having a hard time here getting rid of all the money. Local 24 News reporter Jayla Socek is live for us in the studio this morning working the story. Jayla, you're learning more about how this group is helping others. And John, the Low Income Home Energy Assistance Program has a lot of money they need to distribute. $10 million to be exact, and they know that there are a lot of people in the Shelby County area that are in need. The problem is they're having trouble giving that money away because not enough people know about the program and how it can help them. And they help pay utility bills for people that are low income, living above or at the federal poverty guideline. Depending on income and family size, people can get up to $650. The organization's funding went from $9 million to $19 million for the year, with its deadline approaching. The increased financial support means they stand a chance to double the number of families they serve. In a normal year, they assist 16,000 families. Supervisor Yolanda Rhodes says people don't have to wait for a cutoff notice to receive help. It, it, sometimes it's hard work asking for help. So we're just, we're wanting people to know that the funds are available. It's unfortunate, a lot of people don't know that this agency exists. So knowing that someone's there to help when I need them is just so important. The low, the low Income Home Energy Assistance Program is funded by the Tennessee Housing Development Association. A link with more information on applying can be found on our website, localmemphis.com, under the Find It section. In the studio, Jalen Socek, Good Day Memphis.